She said I can't have none of her sauce, y'all. But girl, I don't give a damn. Give me some sauce. That's Tasha. That's Steph. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We gon' eat a little, prank a little. Our story time is the best. Have you L O L when you click play? No, this ain't no click. What's up, y'all? Hey guys, it's Steph and Tasha. We are back with another video. We got seafood ball today. If you're new here, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the family. If you've been here before, welcome back. If you don't know us, this is Stephanie. I'm Tasha. We're married and we have a kid. He was on our channel yesterday. If you want to check it out, check it out. What are we doing today, baby? I mean, you just said it already. You did everything. So, you ready? let's... You can do that I part. Do that you can do that part. Go ahead. Let's get into the video. All right, guys, we're back. So today, Tasha has made every piece of seafood that we had in our refrigerator. Okay? The freezer. Mm -hmm. We got king crab, snow crab. Um, Dungeness crab, shrimp, sausage, mm. Uh, mm. we got some bell pepper, corn, boiled mm. eggs, <laughs> and potatoes, y'all. Did I miss anything, baby? Nope. This is a lot of food. Mm -hmm. Eggs. Sheesh. Um, mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. I've already tasted it because I'm hungry as heck. So oh, you have? I already know it's bomb, y'all. Look at these shrimp. She sauteed. You sauteed these, right? I sure did. Oh. Look at I sauteed them in orange pepper and Delicious. lime. Oh no! Nah. Come on now. Mm. Oh lord, they don't even need a sauce, y'all. They good. Oh, that's bomb. Thank you. Mm. Shantae cleaned the shrimp, so um, who Shantae? I mean Stephanie. Oh lord. I'm not trying to prank you, okay? Are you sure? <laughs> no. First of all, who the hell is Shantae? I don't know. I could be talking uh, to somebody. Are well, you trying to prank me? Uh huh. Yep, you got you like if you prank with somebody else's name, mm -hmm. it has to be like your ex or something. It can't just be a random <clears throat> name. Gotcha. The only way that works is if <laughs> I thought you was cheating or something. Like if I didn't trust you. Yeah. Like wait a minute, but, but. I could just be good though, and then you don't even know. It could be, but I'm just, I'm just telling you how. I mean, supposedly call you them. cheating on me. That's true. Remember? Mm-hmm. Well, Corey. Yeah. Stephanie cheating on me. Woo! Woo. This bell pepper actually gives it a little spice. Because I don't have anything really spicy in mine, but... Mm. It's bomb, babe. Thank you. No, thank you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. So today, y'all, we ain't got nothing. Nope. Going on. I did find... A little short viewer topic that <clears throat> I guess we'll do. I was thinking about just going down in our uh, Instagram DMs and reading some of the stuff. I'm like reading our Instagram DMs. I mean, what wait. about the comments uh, on the Corey video? I don't have them ready. Oh, okay. Oh, we can just go on there. It but could. this is probably going to take too long. I don't know who's going to do it because I'm eating. <laughs> I knew you wasn't going to do it. Mm. Mm -mm. I'm glad you suggested this today. Me too. Because I wanted it, but I sure didn't want to cook it, y'all. It's so mm -hmm. hot. <clears throat> I really wanted it, so I was like, let me go on and make us a mm -hmm. seafood boil. This DMB sauce, y'all. DMB. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm really stuck on DMB right now. I mixed my sauce with um, a little bit too time spicy. Really? Is it good? Mm -hmm. Let me try it. No. Okay. That's fine. Mm. Mm. All I'm getting is butter though, because I'm staying at the top. Mm. <clears throat> it's good, huh, babe? Mm -hmm. Everything is bomb. I don't even want to take the shell out. I wish I could break the oh, crab. So like, oh, y'all can't even see me, huh? Y'all can't even see me. I can't ever see your butt. I don't want them seeing my butt. Mm. This is so good, Angel. You keep. Oh, you call me what? Let me play this out for her, y'all. What? What you call me? No. Mm. Mm. I need a good prank, y'all. I mean, some people think pranks are immature. I don't care. I like them. I think they're fun, funny. Exactly. And uh, y'all like them, obviously, or you wouldn't be watching them. So to me, whether they're fake or not, if you are entertained, that's the whole purpose of our lives. Right. 
Okay? I've always been goofy. Whew. Girl. <laughs> I mean, we that's how my family was. I mean, we always joked around. And obviously, my parents were grown, so they were old jokers, and they loved to have fun. My dad used to prank us at least four times a week. For real? Yes, some, in some kind of way. I'd mean, I'd rather, I'd much rather have my parents pranking me than my parents not paying any attention to me. Right. Or my wife pranking me. It's fun. Right. It's never that serious. Man, you never get too old to have a little fun. Now, you, if you just don't act into pranks, then fine. I mean, I understand that, but mm. loosen up. Yeah, if you're not into it, that's different. Have a little fun. But everybody has their way of having fun. Right. Um, no matter how old you are. Some people find it fun to sit there and watch Bloomberg all day. Me. She said I can't have none of her sauce, y'all. But girl, I don't give a damn. Give me some sauce. You really ain't gonna give me no sauce? Today? I was just playing, babe. Well, how was I supposed to get it? I don't know. I was just gonna keep eating it. Oh my god. Damn. Your elbow? Mm. Her sauce something hot, y'all? No, it's not. Oh, you mean spicy? I mean, you mean temperature? Yes. But yeah, it's hot. Delicious. I can't really taste the Oh, wait, look at the potatoes. Oh. I don't know. Mm, shit. She sure is sure. Because I've been thinking about these the whole time. Me too. When I saw how you cooked them, it was like a. Mm. You, you roasted, stewed, mm -hmm. pan sauteed all in one. Mm hmm. 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 I use olive oil. Oh, another little skin. Not that it matters because all this butter. I'm glad we don't do seafood boils that much anymore. What should I put on top of this, y'all? Mm. Some dungy. Yep. You making a potato volcano? Yep, me too. I'm about to make a volcano, y'all. It's always nice, been a minute. A nice little dungeon. It's going to here. Ooh. It is. Put some on it too. So y'all, I'm getting into something. I ain't gonna tell you what it is yet. Drugs. Cause I wanna, you know, I wanna try to master as much as I can before you, before I bring it up and then I, I fail, you know. Yeah. But I'm just letting y'all know. Hope y'all didn't wipe my eyebrow off. Um. Off. I, I just do like that. You got a fake eyebrow? Back? I mean, yeah, some fakeness on it. Does it look uh, right? No. Okay. Um, <coughs> Tasha's <house. coughs> So I'm getting over into this new thing. So my baby, what? It's gonna be more involved than YouTube, right? Yeah. We'll do it. Mhm. Mm no. Yeah, that's why I made this. Go ahead, sweetheart. Thank you. I should just put some of yours in mine. Yeah, see what happens. This is probably gonna be nasty as hell. Let me not do that. No, it's not. With my sauce? Woo! Oh my god, it's hot. Mm. Here, y'all, take that hot ass bite. Actually, just blow it for me. Cool it down for me. Thanks. You think they're your slaves? Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. I feel like a wild animal. You do? Hot, greasy, eating. <laughs> just don't even care. Just sitting here eating like a lion. You know how they just right. eat in the sun? Mm -hmm. Maybe hot. I don't even want my sauce nowhere. That's down good, next to y'all. Eating. Get yourself a bowl, sweetie. I'll stop. That's what I mean. Y'all had to get a little bit of Tasha sauce because it's too bomb today, y'all. Too bomb. Thank you. I'm about to read this little topic I got. Mmm. That was hot. Mm -hmm. I hope y'all look wet because I feel wet. We definitely probably look wet. We do. I forgot to bring my phone, y'all. Sausage and potatoes are one of my favorite things. Okay, so we're doing a viewer topic, y'all. If you guys want to send us a topic, send it to Steph and Tasha on Instagram. Mm. So, I believe this is a female, but I don't think it really matters because 
she's talking about her sibling. Mm, 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 so mm, she mm. says, my brother has been living with me for two years now. When he first moved in, I allowed him to pay me $100 every two weeks. Now that he's full time, he refuses to pay more. He says he can't afford anymore. We live in a four bedroom house, three baths. He has his own room, cable, flat screen TV, all <laughs> the shit. I told him that I don't believe he couldn't pay more and told him to prove it to me, which he refused to do. I served him a 30 day notice okay. to figure it out or get out because I know he can do better. Right. He just refused to do so. He te he's texted me back and told me to leave him alone. How you going? Bitch, I'm your landlord, motherfucker. I might be your sister, but I'm also your landlord, little poo poo. How you going to leave me alone? Get out, and I will. Right. Leave me alone. I'm trying to leave you alone. <laughs> Shit. I, I want you to leave me alone. How about that? Right. He said he'll get out on the 1st, but his 30 day notice ends on the 23rd of the month. What would you do? So now he's been living there for two years, okay? So take that into consideration, too. Let him leave on the first. Give him to the first? Yes, yeah, since he's saying that he can. If he really leave. Whatever. If he, if he doesn't, then you got you do something about it. Yeah. I mean, it is your brother. You can give him to the first. You can give him another one more week. Yeah, give him another week. And then he got to hit the road. I bet you he don't even leave. <laughs> Please update us with this story because I. I just have a feeling he ain't gonna be ready to leave on the first either. Mm -mm. If he ain't left in two years and he claimed he can't do nothing more, then that means he probably don't have nothing saved up. Or either he does, but just don't no. want to help her. No. He got the money. He just been used to since he's full time now. He's been used to spending mm -hmm. whatever he's spending and giving her a hundred dollars a month. So I he wants to keep doing it. I feel like he's been spending his money. Though. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. I don't think he got the money to leave. Oh no, he probably doesn't. So that's what I'm saying. I think he's still going to be there on the first. I mean, he's full time. I don't know what he was before. Maybe he didn't even have a job before. I don't know. But being my brother, I would give my brother until the first. If you were in this situation, do you think you would have served him 30 notice? Or just let him... I know how you are. I feel like you would let your siblings stay there forever. Ah, uh, ah, ah. Uh... I don't feel like I would have given him a 30 day notice, but I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Okay. But I would have told him he has to go. Ain't no 30 day notice about the, the this is family. Get the hell out of my house. <laughs> get the hell out. Okay. That's it. I don't I feel like you should, should have to it. serve your family a 30 day notice. I think you should be able to tell your family, Bye. get the hell out. Right. I mean, I know legally you have to serve a 30 day notice. So if he's really on that kind of stuff, then yeah, that's something you have to do. And if he's on that kind of, sh then yeah, I probably would make him get out. Mm -hmm. The bad thing is that. Of course, you always want to help your family, but it's like you do have to have some kind of boundaries in place, like in the beginning, mm -hmm. so y'all both know. Okay, how long are you staying? How long do you need to stay? Um, I do think he should, especially. It don't seem like he was about to leave before she was like, "Get out!" Right? Right. So why wouldn't he just pay a little bit more? If you're gonna end up staying here, now I can see if he was saving to leave, but you just gonna be a greedy asshole mm -hmm. and not help me more with the rent and stuff. That's not cool. I don't know. Yeah, I would have an issue. I would too. So you want me to take the brunt of the bills while you live it up and buy everything you want? That's not good. Mm-mm. Y'all ain't even a type of... I don't know. When you gonna find a woman if he's that, that type of person? Ever. Yeah. Not that a woman means anything. I was watching something last night. It was actually a crime show. But it's kind of... has something to do with this. this. This girl, she needed a place to live. Well, her husband was abusive or whatever. So she left him. She moved to, I think, uh, Florida from Chicago. She left her kids in um, Chicago. I'm sorry, Ohio, because she wanted to get herself together. So she moved in with her sister. Her sister had a husband known. Her, the sister's husband was like, okay, so she was trying to get like a, a, a job as a chef at like a diner or something. He was like, nah. He was like, you're not about to be staying here going to get no chef job. That ain't going to make no money. You ain't going to be able to get out. I don't want you in my house forever. What do you want her to do? He wanted her to he wanted her to go to school. Oh. Um, which is kind of good. No, he's just the type of person that you knew you need to make money. You need to do better. It was all about money for him. So he was like, no, if you're doing this chef thing, you gotta go. So he basically told his wife, your sister gotta get out of my house. Because she ain't doing nothing. So she put her sister out, which she didn't want to. Well, she didn't put her sister out. Her sister was like, oh, I'm gonna go ahead and leave. Um damn. so she ended up leaving, but 
it was in a hotel, it was a bad area. I don't know. Her sister was like, no, you got to come back. Her husband was mad. That's a lot. It is a lot. Because if your, like, for instance, if my brother needed to live here or somebody needed to live here and you're my wife and I know how you are, you'd be like, yeah, cool. But are you going to sit up here and let my brother live here rent free for 10 years? That's a lot. You're going to feel some kind of way mm -mm. about your own family. I'm like, I'm moving. You know? <laughs> All right, Tasha, bye. Bye, y'all. You and your brother can live your life. <laughs> this is how I eat corn, You right? just never know. Because it's like, you don't want to see your family out on the streets, but right. also you ain't about to take advantage of me. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna let you take it back. I'm working all hard while you live in the lavish life at my house. Mm -hmm. mm -mm, that's gonna irritate the hell out of me. But not everybody is doing that. Some people are. They're taking advantage of their siblings or whoever, their family, and not doing anything. But some people, like, maybe they can't find a job. You know, they've been looking, but they haven't been able to find one yet. Maybe because they're not educated. Maybe because they were in jail at one point. That's kind of hard. But I feel like everybody can find something. To I was going to say something. Everybody can find some kind especially of Especially with all these apps out now. Yeah. With the apps especially. You could be doing Postmates all that stuff. Something. Mm -hmm. You know? I feel like if you just can't find nothing in years, something. I don't know. I feel like you really don't want to find nothing. Not years. No, my mom was deaf. And although she did not have a job all the time. She found jobs sometimes. If a deaf person that can't even hear, I don't even know what kind of jobs they can get, can get a job than an able-bodied <coughs> person. Right. She was able-bodied, but should be able to get a job. And then if you're at the point where you feel like you really don't have any skills to get you a job, at least go to school. I mean, you, you've been here for two years anyway. Mm -hmm. You might as well go to school. School is going to do something. That's more than what you've been bringing in anyway. Yeah, show me you trying to do something. That's all I'm saying. Mm-hmm. Anyway, y'all, pretty sure we at the mm -hmm. time to go. Mm -hmm. What time is it? 21. Tasha ain't going nowhere. <laughs> I'm going right into this corn. <laughs> All right, y'all, we about to go. If y'all like the video, give it a thumbs up, comment, and let Wait, me know what you guys think. I didn't get him a bite. Here. Yeah. Ooh, they don't want that? Yes, here go you on guys the bite, go. Who wants to bite this? I bet one person out there want to bite it. Please subscribe to our vlog channel. The link is in the description below. Make sure you set your post notifications to all so you don't miss any of, day, any of our daily, daily uploads, uploads, live streams, or, or premieres. premieres. And until next time, only goodbye. Peace. Peace.